Hey guys and girls, I'm Ali and today we're watching Red vs. Blue, the season 3 finale, so episodes 55 to 57. Um, last time we had the whole, like, we ended the whole church ordeal, uh, where he had multiple versions of himself and in the end just did what I told him to, basically. Um, he stood with the others to finally not get bumped back, but to the front. And then we ha had the whole church can still talk to the computer, Gary. Um, and they defused the bomb, which is called Andrew or Andy, um, who can talk. And everyone thought Caboose was crazy, but he can actually talk. I'm curious what will happen now. The Reds got a distress signal too, and um, Simmons complained that he can't do anything without equipment because that's true. You know, I mean, he is part metal machine, whatever, but I don't think he has like an interface that he can just use for everything. I mean, maybe he has, but I don't think so. Yeah, um, I guess we will just see what will happen at the end of season three. I'm curious about it. Yeah, do they follow the distress signal at some point or do they not? Or is something gonna happen about this weird prophecy thingy or are Gary and Andy still gonna fight? <laughs> but yeah, this episode is like the, the first of the batch is called Diffusing the Situation, so it could have something to do with Andy. But yeah, I guess we'll just go and see. And if you like this video, you can give it a thumbs up or you can subscribe if you wanna see more of this. And in the description down below, there's two links one to the Discord server, which you can gladly join. Join us in our escapades and our shenanigans. Um, and also the link to the Patreon, where there's no red versus blue, because um, I'm not gonna go against Rooster Teeth. I'm not gonna put the content behind a paywall. Um, I'm not making any money out of red versus blue reactions at all. And that's fine, because I watch it because I like it. So then, let's go with episode 55 in three, two, one, and go. <laughs> You're trying to tell us that this bomb can talk. I'm not telling you that. He's telling you that. Yeah, and I'm standing right here. You can talk to me. If you could talk hmm. the whole time, then why didn't you just... Wait, why am I talking to a bomb? I'm not doing this. What, am I not good enough to talk to? Wow. You are some kind of too good to talk to a bomb type? Maybe it's a good idea not to piss off the explosive device. Yes, agree. maybe. I wasn't talking about you, Tex. Hey, why did you suck my... Did Gary say anything about the bomb being able to talk? Uh, just that this whole place is going to be destroyed by us, and that Andy here is probably the thing that does it? Oh. Wow. Well, That's not good. I don't think so. Bunch of shit knows if you ask me. No one did ask me, which I find insulting. All right, all right, calm down, Andy, calm down. Yeah. Don't tell me to calm down. I am calm. Caboose, calm this thing Don't down explode, it please. Andy, everyone here is your friend, and no one wants to hurt you. Yeah, right. Come on, Andy. Andy is butthurt. Now, what makes you happy? Being in the middle of a huge explosion. Less happy place, Caboose. Less happy place. Yeah. Uh, think calming thoughts. Uh, let's count backwards for cat. No, because Nine. that's a countdown. Eight. Yeah. No. Okay, I'm 95% certain that the distress signal is coming from that way. Excellent work, sir. Okay, we're back to the distress right, signal Gus. stuff. And Griff, let's get ready to roll. <laughs> Only 95% certain. Griff, if there's one thing that I've learned in working with you, is that there's always margin for error. Excellent comeback, Simmons. That's Why a not? Thank you, sir. Har har, look who's so smart. 
It's pronounced margarine, dumbass. Seriously, if I ever meet the guy that assigned you to our squad, I'm gonna kill him. Well, if you're 95% certain it's that way, which way's the other 5%? What do you think? All the other directions. Then I think that's the way we should go. You might be the dumbest person I have ever All the met. other directions. And I think you're just covering your ass. Really? Hey, Sarge! <laughs> what? I'm that not is not a real direction to go to cover in. yours. No way. Stop arguing, you two! Simmons isn't covering his ass, and Griff certainly isn't covering his. No one's ass is being covered. Got it? No, not. What do you want? Uh, is that a trick question? No, good. Well, I was up on the windmill again, and I think I found a route we can take out of here. Right. Hmm. Load up. So, Donut, Donut, Donut actually did something. Yes, sir. Okie dokie. Griff, you get in the base and distract the balloons while we get ready to leave. You're sending Griff? Okay. Be right back. Griff? Don't you remember the last time you sent him to distract Command during our surprise inspection? He told him we were all in the base doing last minute cleaning because we all had cholera and we were in quarantine for a month. Hmm. My ass still hurts from all the shots wow. we got. Yeah, you can say that again. Quarantine what for a month. Too. How there, bad Donut. could that be? Oh, I thought we were just sharing stuff. Wait a second. You guys better not just be sending me so you can run off once I'm inside. Of course not, moron. Now hurry up. Okay, everybody in the Jeep. You are in a cool room <sighs> where no one disturbs you or calls you names. Like Bobby. Or don't say the names. Floating jerk. The river was a good start. By, the kind that don't blow up. You are happy. But not overly happy. Regular happy. Regular happy. And out through the mouth. Again. <laughs> Standing around him. Who's there? You know, piece of serenity. I already heard that one. And when we get there, we'll radio command and say we need a replacement because we have absolutely no idea what happened to. Oh, Griff! What are you doing back so soon? That was the shortest distraction of all time. What's wrong? Yeah, they're what already the distracted. You know? I can honestly say I have no idea what I just saw. Can I quit the army now? Seriously, I think I've seen everything I need to see at this point. <laughs> People okay, talking to a bob happen. and trying to make it I mean, happy, just tell me what it but not like too happy. I'm done. Ooh. Venga, Ooh. Ejército Robot Robo army. <laughs> Lopez might just be ahead, <laughs> but he can still do a lot. <laughs> I need a device intact. <laughs> now kill all those fools. And those fools over there. And those fools. And those fools. And those fools. <laughs> Fun stuff, fun stuff. Next up. Okay, so let me get this straight. They were talking to the bomb. Dude, yes. I don't know. They mentioned something about candles in a bubble bath. And they were playing some kind of a new age CD. It's like a Yanni fan club meeting. That makes no sense at all. Did you want to translate for us, Pinky Pants? My guess is... Well, you weren't the there. For them. And all that sweet talking candles will work on a bomb. It would work on me. Don't you see what they're trying to do? No. Isn't that the point of this conversation? Blues are obviously trying to coax the bomb into rearming. They're about no. to launch an attack on us. Not really. Why would they do that? Because they're blues. Somebody get this kid the manual. Oh, I hate the blues. That's the spirit, Simmons. <laughs> Basically, now, no. Yeah, they that. just try to make it, it not explode at all. Button. He means robot mignones. Where's your cultural sensitivity? Oh, shut up. At last, we will seize our destiny! Do we really have to seize destiny? Can't we just invite it to join our online circle of friends? Quit, you fool! Quit okay, I, I'm fight. just gonna add destiny Propel to my friends. We will break upon the fortress like an evil wind! Oh. Crushing our opponents with lightning speed! Attack! Charge! <laughs> this totally enthusiastic... Charge. And you in the back. Lopez, can't you speed him up? Maximum velocity. This is what I asked for. This is this que quieres esta día de victoria. 
a este balacidad va a pasar de wow. cuatro horas para ganar. He... Wow. So that is basically. George. So we cool here? Uh, I think we're finally. He, calm he down. actually listened yeah. to him, so that's a plus point. Now. We are not mad, and we are definitely not thinking about exploding at all anymore. Hey. Caboose, no. Are you talking about me? What? No, of course not. We just want to make sure that we're all happy and that we're not upset in any way whatsoever. Don't say we. You really mean me. I mean you, which in this case is me. No, no, no. Uh, okay. We're, uh, we're talking about Tex. Excuse me? Hey, you want to die in an explosion? Play along. Yeah. Yeah, um, okay, just talk about Tex. I don't know if you've noticed, but she's, uh, she's kind of a bitch. Isn't that right, Tex? I don't know. Come on, Tex. <laughs> yes, we're talking about me. Sounds like you're patronizing me. Oh, no. Oh, really? It's me? It's I'm making it bitch. worse. <laughs> Keep going. And I need to be calmed down all the time. Or what happens? Or else I get so mad, I kill people on my own team. I see your point. Tell them about yeah, the hmm. And the crankiness. Also mention that you like to punch people in the head while they sleep. That was you? I thought that Josh Barry was mad at me. Wow. She sounds like a real handful. All right, listen, you little new firecracker. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, no. Do you mean any? Volatile. I am so going to remember this, Church. You should sleep with your pillow on top of your head tonight. Yes, that's very funny. Make all the threats you want. Okay. As long as everyone is calm and peaceful and there's nothing else to make us excited, I don't care. Yeah, and there's the robot army. Feel that coming right as I finish the sentence. Yeah, um... Rearmed the bomb. Wait, they rearmed it and it exploded. Isn't that good for us? Griff, don't interrupt me when it's I'm not them. in a battle situation. We're in battle? Of course we are. Now get ready for your orders. Donut. Yes, sir. Scream like a woman. Can do. Ah! Griff. What? Prepare to sacrifice yourself to save a nearby superior officer. I don't think I've been trained on that. Simmons, okay. Kiss ass and sacrifice Both himself. Both and a handsome man, sir. Excellent That's... work, Simmons. A weird order for a battle. Permission to assist donuts, sir. Permission denied. Continue with Operation Meat Shield. Remember, just because your bones are broken doesn't mean they won't stop bullets from hitting me. Now get out there. The call okay. Sir, on your way to um. metal, Simmons. In fact, metal's all the way around. Purple heart for Grip. Pink heart for Donut. Donut, can you just stop Simmons. for a moment? Okay, Donut, okay. We get it. And now episode 57, The Storm. And I guess we will just deal with the robot army in this one. Charge. Charge. <laughs> oh, for God's sake, will you hurry up? Lopez, I'm disappointed in your work. As long as they're still moving. You don't even have legs, and you still got up here faster than them. Usted es los cerebros en esta operación. Yo no más soy el músculo. They may be slow, but their posture is excellent. <sighs> a for effort, Lopez. Let's use this chance to slip away. Great idea, sir. I have a lock on that distress signal. We can head right for it. Good thinking, Simmons. Everybody in the jeep. Shotgun. Shotgun. Fuck. Shotgun slap. Fuck. There's just no room for four people. Someone will have to jog alongside. Grip. Hmm. Jog? What's that? It's like running slowly. Dear God, you don't running know what jogging slowly. means? <laughs> yeah, you lost me at running. Sorry, it's not my contract. Oh, don't worry, I'll do it. Just give me one second while I put my jogging shorts on. Wait, I want to reconsider. Who wants to hold my ankles while I stretch out my hammies? Oh, uh, yeah. Twice, donut. Um, you're still gonna be in your armor. All right, I so... think I can take him. I just need a better weapon. Want me to help you find one? Mm, 
Why don't you just give me your sword? <laughs> no, wait. Yeah, I can see right there. Um, you employee. Of course you would go for that. Sword. That's what I just said. Yeah, but it's the way you said it. You know, it's a good thing that that sword doesn't run on brain power. Oh my god, Tucker. Look, hot chicks. Nice try. You just want me to turn around so you can knock me out and take the sword. Now the hot girls are making out. Okay, that's worth the risk. Um, oh, crap. Yeah. That's definitely not happening right now. <laughs> Just stay calm, Andy. Caboose is still trying to calm him calm. down. Okay, really, I like explosions. You, on the other hand, look a little nervous. You know, I always get a little nervous during battles. I think it's because we never win. Yeah. yeah, don't sweat it. Fair point. If they get in the base, I'll just explode and kill everybody. Wouldn't that kill us too, yeah. Andy? Yeah. Hey, you can't make an omelet without blowing up a few eggs. Okay. I like eggs. Me too. Gary, is it possible At least they get along. To an entire army of people? No. The Great Destroyer is a single person who will come to claim the Great Weapon. Yeah, that's great. Prepare. One and all. The fulfillment of the great prophecy is at hand. Hmm. No good news for me today. Weren't you glad I didn't say the man up? Ready. Let's go, man. <laughs> we'll claim the great weapon. So is the great weapon the thing Tex just took? To leave someone behind. Is she Not the great destroyer? It. What? No way! You're leaving me behind? Sorry, no not, but military law is very clear in regards to the not it methodology for making decisions. Oh man! Hmm. There's still so much about the army I don't understand. Here he comes! Donut, you hide here and wait for the guy tailing us. Then when he passes, shoot him square in the back and watch him die. Just like John Wayne would have done. Hurry up, guys. He's getting closer. Sure. No, wait. No, he... Yeah, he is getting closer. No. Yes! Oh, yeah, that guy is very slow. In the back. Doesn't sound very noble. We're not retreating. We're advancing. Towards future victory. How am I going to find you guys? Just follow the distress signal to its source. You'll find us there. But I don't have a way to track it. Um. Excellent point, Donut. Thank They're you, just sir. leaving him behind. Aww. Poor Donut. <sighs> what you gonna do? Wait. And wait. Oh, God. And wait. Well, I've got some time. Yeah, <laughs> you have plenty of time. <laughs> faster! Faster! Pathetic. Dermit! How do I say faster in Spanish? Yes. Yeah, they're not gonna go faster. Oh god. Now you just... That was rather long to mean hurry up. Es una lengua muy poética. Oh, man. Beautiful. That creepy dude. Very beautiful. I wonder why he's insulting himself. Que curioso. Oh, the motorcycle. Hmm. Don't let him speak. Mi cola es muy grande. Okay. Me gusta frotar mi cola. Y quiero oler mi cola y también besar a mi cola. Really? Are you sure cola means evil? Jefe, alguien está robando su... Yeah. Drat! I only had two payments left! Tienes seguranza? Of course not! Por qué? It's just a scam. Vivemos en un barrio... We live in a bad neighborhood. Of course we live in a bad neighborhood. We're evildoers! We're what makes the neighborhood bad. Whoa, Tucker, are you okay? I don't think so. Uh, mm. oh, damn. Okay, new rule. We start rotating knockouts. Next time, it's your turn. Hey, good idea. And next time Caboose decides he wants to go around team killing, you can take that one. Maybe we should all stick to what we know best. Mm. Hey, where's your weapon? You think she knocked me out for fun? This isn't Tuesday, dude. She took it. Man, this is not gonna be good. Well... Attack. Una araña. What is that? Uh-oh. Yeah, um... Your... Army? The Great Destroyer has arrived. The end is near. The Great Destroyer has arrived. The end is near. The Great Destroyer. No mas robos de las muertas. Destroying the army that it attacks. So. I'm going to sneak around the side. 
Let me know if you see anything. Yeah, what 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 thing is that? Lopez! What what is that Lopez! wooden whatever? He's not gonna Got die, is trigger, he? Guys. You stole that thing all by yourself? Yep. And then I ran over the guy that was chasing us. And a few other innocent pedestrians. I'm so proud of you. Yeah. Donut did Stealing and killing are pretty a well, I, I guess. I started at a much younger age. I caught the fever. Okay, the source of the distress signal is right outside. Yeah, I, I guess. I mean, <laughs> in that situation. We're back! <laughs> wow. She really did a lot of damage. Are you surprised? No, not really. I guess not. I tell you what, it stays like today, and I'm uh -oh. really glad she's on our side. Who's on our side? Whoa! Who killed all the robots? You did. It's no, not her. I've been downstairs trying to figure out how to turn this sword on. Wait a second. Just push the power button. I did. That didn't work. Yeah, that's surprising. And is near. The great destroyer has arrived. The end is near. The so, great destroyer has arrived. The great destroyer has arrived. The end is near. Oh, come on, Gary, Gary, Gary. Stop, 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 stop. Hey, if Tex is not the destroyer from the prophecy, then who is? Gary? Gary? Knock, knock. Who's there? Oh. Um. So, cliffhanger? No, we won't start with this right now. Um, um, the Great Destroyer has arrived. Um, we're just not informed about who that is exactly. It was a blue figure. So was it Caboose? <laughs> or like someone entirely different? I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. So, I'm really happy that I decided to watch the first episodes of the next season today already, because this was a, uh, not a fun way to end it. <laughs> this was basically a cliffhanger right now, because Church is about to be attacked. Um, yeah. The red team is in Blood Gulch again. Because why not? Why wouldn't they be? Right? Fun times. Fun times. Um, it's it's kind of a weird end for like a a season. Um, since you know. It, it didn't really, like, feel like an ending, but, you know, it was a cliffhanger, so I guess I'll give it that. Um, so, yeah. <sighs> what did we all have? Like, okay, first we thought, okay, maybe Tex could be the Great Destroyer because she took the weapon. But she couldn't turn it on, so... How, how did this really, like, did she have the weapon or did she just have something that didn't work and that, and the other person took the weapon? Um, I don't know. I really don't know. But, um, I guess we'll find out a little bit more next time, um, hopefully. Um... And he still didn't explode. Yeah, and technically he was talking, like, Caboose and Andy were talking about stuff, so what do they do right now? Are they still talking? Or whatever? I have no idea. I'm, I'm just a little confused about the situation at the moment. Um, I guess the robot army is dead. So, our bad guy team is, again, down to our initial three. Um, yeah, reds and blues are already divided again, basically. Um, Donut took the vehicle, which is fun. <laughs> 
he just shouldn't go around just killing people, maybe. Um, that kind of uh, threw me off a little, but, you know, at least something happened. But yeah, um, so what I was asking myself before, um, I don't know if it was in this video or in the previous video when we saw the, I think it was the previous video when we saw the pictures of the blood gold sh thing and I was just like, hmm, is this gonna be like the last time we see it? But apparently it's not. Um, it's the place again it's the same place they were at um just you know in the next game basically but yeah um i don't think i have anything else to say about that i'll just really i'm just really like curious about what happens next because cliffhanger so on this note have a nice day and i see you in the next video bye